Data analytics is one of the hottest career paths in 2025. Companies everywhere are desperate for people who can take messy numbers and transform them into powerful insights. But here's the big question. How do you actually break into data analytics right now, even if you don't have years of experience? In this video, I'm going to give you a step-by-step -step roadmap. By the end, you'll know the exact tools to learn, the projects to build, and the moves to make if you want to land a data analyst role this year. So grab a notebook or open your notes app. Let's get started. First, let's talk about why this matters. The demand for data analysts is exploding. Every industry healthcare, finance, marketing, sports, and even government runs on data. Businesses want clarity and analysts provide it. The average starting salary in the U.S. right now sits between sixty-five dollars and $85,000. And as you specialize, whether in finance, healthcare, or tech, you can easily push into six figures. And here is the best part. You don't even need a Ph.D. or 10 years of experience. You just need the right skills and a portfolio that proves you can do the work. So let's break this down. Step 1. Master the core tools. Start with Excel and Google Sheets. They may feel basic, but they're still the number one tools used every single day. Learn pivot tables, conditional formatting, VLOOKUP, and basic dashboard building. Next, learn SQL. This is the universal language of databases, and almost every data analyst job description will list it as a requirement. If you only learn one technical skill, make it SQL then move to Python or R if you prefer. Python is perfect for data cleaning, automation, and more advanced analysis. Get comfortable with libraries like Pandas, NumPy, and Matplotlib. You'll also need a visualization tool. Power BI and Tableau are industry favorites. These let you tell stories with data and make your work stand out in presentations. And if you want a bonus skill that gives you an edge explore cloud platforms, AWS, Azure, and Google Cloud all have powerful data tools. Learning how to use a data warehouse like BigQuery or Snowflake makes you instantly more valuable. Pause here and take a moment. Which of these tools do you already know and which ones do you need to focus on next? Write it down. Step 2. Build practical projects. Tools are useless without practice. Start small. Download a data set from Kaggle. Analyze COVID-19 trends in your country. Create a dashboard that tracks NBA player stats. Or scrape open data from your city's website to find patterns in housing or traffic. The goal is to prove you can take raw data, clean it, analyze it, and tell a story. Upload your projects to GitHub or share them on LinkedIn. Trust me, a strong portfolio speaks louder than a resume. Step 3. Certifications and Structured Learning while they're not required, certifications can speed up your journey. The Google Data Analytics Certificate, Microsoft Power BI Certification, or even AWS Data Analytics Badges are excellent options. They don't guarantee a job, but they give you credibility, structure, and motivation. Step 4. Build Soft Skills Data analysts don't just crunch numbers. They communicate insights. The best analysts are storytellers. They explain data clearly, influence decisions, and make complexity simple. Work on your presentation skills. Practice summarizing findings in plain English. Because in the end, clarity is your superpower. And step five, network and land opportunities. Breaking into analytics often comes down to who knows about your skills. Post your projects on LinkedIn. Comment on other analysts' work. Join communities like Data Talks, or Kaggle discussions. And of course apply. Entry-level analyst roles, internships, or even freelance gigs on sites like Upwork are all ways to get started. The key is momentum. Don't wait for the perfect opportunity. Take the first step and keep building. So here's the truth. Breaking into data analytics isn't about being perfect. It's about being consistent. Learn the tools, build projects, share your work, and connect with others. Every data set you analyze brings you closer to the career you want. Now it's your turn. Drop a comment below and tell me which tool you're going to focus on first. Excel, SQL, Python, 
or something else. Let's grow together. If you found this video helpful, hit like, subscribe, and turn on the bell so you don't miss future videos. And remember, clarity isn't just about numbers, it's about direction. See you in the next video.